today's video, let's learn how to quickly and easily create a new project. When you've decided to create a new project, once you're inside your project's dashboard, simply come up here and there's a button called Create New Projects. Once we click on that, we have a pop-up window where we can now begin naming our project. So let's imagine that today we want to create a simple nursery rhymes project. In this field, I'll paste in nursery rhymes or type in nursery rhymes. And as you can see, the invocation name is filled out for you once you put that in there. Don't overthink this because you can change any of this information at any time and we'll certainly change everything or update everything before we publish the skill. Once we have our project name, we'll come down here to category and we'll find a category that it would fit best. You can scroll up and down and read all of these. And in this situation, well, I think if I look right there, there is children's education and reference, games, music, audio. Hey, children's novelty and humor sounds like that would be the best one. And then you can publish this in many locations, but I suggest always starting with just one. And then after you've get it built, then you can decide to publish in other ones as well. So I'm going to leave it at English US. Then I need a project icon and I'll click on this and there's literally hundreds upon hundreds of icons here and you can just search. You can put an F in here and as you see, there's that. If you put in there, how about food? and hit search, well, there's tons and tons of things that come up. Well, I'm going to just type in there, how about nursery, and see what comes up. And there's two icons. Now, it's important to note right here, I'm going to really upgrade my account and update this because there's literally millions of different icons, and I can find something that's really unique and something much better. But for now, I'm just going to keep it simple, and I'll choose this one, and I'll upgrade it later. Now, right here at the very bottom, I'm just going to pick something very simple, something generic, just as a reminder of what this project is all about. And then, as I said earlier, we'll update all of this stuff before we publish it. Now, once I have this bit of information in, I'll click the Create button. Within moments, as you can see, there is our nursery rhyme skill. And as you see, it has a little bitty description that helps me to remember what it is that I'm doing right here and what I'm going to make out of it. Then at any time I want to actually begin working on this, I just simply click on this icon and it will bring me into the visual editor right here so that I can now begin working on this skill. And at any time, whenever I'm done working on it, I don't need to look for a save button because the platform will save everything for you as you're editing. So while I'm working and I've decided I'm done, well, I want to go back home. How do I go home? Well, I've got two ways to do it. I can come right here and click on the logo, which serves as a home, or I can come right over here to this icon and you see it says projects. I can click on that and it will bring me home and home is your projects dashboard. And that's it for this video.